Shades of the World, Exploring Skin Colors There was excitement in the busy village as the yearly diversity festival was about to begin. Kids and grown-ups from different places gathered in the square, wearing colorful clothes. Among them were Maya, a curious rabbit, and Leo, an adventurous cat. Maya hopped over to Leo. Leo, why do people have different skin colors? Look, everyone looks so unique. Leo pondered for a moment before responding. Well, Maya, it's an interesting question. You see, the primary reason for different skin colors lies in our genes. Genes are like tiny instructions that determine various aspects of our bodies, including the amount of a pigment called melanin in our skin. Intrigued. Maya tilted her head. Melanin? What does it do? Leo chuckled. Melanin is really cool, Maya. It's like a natural sunscreen. When we're exposed to the sun's rays, melanin helps protect our skin from getting damaged. That's why some people have darker skin, as they produce more melanin to guard against strong sunlight near the equator. Maya nodded, absorbing the information. So, our skin color is the result of genetics and the environment? Leo smiled. Exactly. Another interesting thing is that as humans have traveled and settled in different parts of the world throughout history, their genes adapted to the unique conditions in those regions. Over time, this led to the development of various skin colors as a result of natural selection. The friends joined the jubilant crowd, celebrating diversity and appreciating the beauty of every individual they encountered. As they chuckled and danced along with their new friends, Maya whispered mischievously, Leo, did you know that even though our skin colors differ, we all have the same color of blood running through our veins? Leo laughed, feeling grateful for the valuable lesson they had learned about embracing and celebrating the wonderful tapestry of humanity.